<coughs> Hi, this is Daniel Zana. I'm basically responding to somebody who actually commented on my video about um, my video that was actually sent to Blake Cousins, which I got no response from him, um, about him make, making money out of the topic of extraterrestrials and also um, in the process throwing in 90% fake footage and things and as well promoting the anti-extraterrestrial agenda uh, which is done with sensationalism and all that. Um, first of all, and I, as you can see, non-profit and activism, because I protest against the amount of money that um, the, um, that people make money out of extraterrestrials. So uh, this person, Bill Forper, had commented. Conveniently, I can't reply. Conveniently. Says people have to pay bills to put food on the table. Why would anyone think of getting the word about eating? It also means needed. To first of all, um, first of all, people who make money out of the top of the thresholds do it to make money, other than to um, provide or or bring up the truth about extraterrestrials. They mainly gather information, whether it's valid or invalid. Most of the time it's invalid because they, all they do is bite on sensationalism. And sensationalism sells. And sensationalism is misinformation. And um, this is why, how and why I, when I do my truth, when I search and research, this is one of the factors I looked at. Is the person being genuine, are they truthful or not about their experiences? Do they share their experiences in order to sell or do they um um or they do or they um uh, do the information to sh uh, show truth? Um, what the hell is TPM? Seriously, this is one thing that annoys me about uh, people who are infected by the money disease. They tend to like these abbreviations and they tend to throw in... It's basically, you're saying, what the hell is TPM? What the fuck? That's, is that Blake Cousins or what? I don't know. Um, the thing is, 90% of the stuff is fake. And I know this because of what have I experienced. And um, and and most of it, and often um, the information that they they put on there is all sensationalism, in order to make money out of the topic of extraterrestrials. Extraterrestrials do not want to be cash cows, uh, or seen as mechanisms to make money out of them. And um, I know this from fact personally. Um, you know, as as I, I, I say myself as a, a, a as a hybrid, um, how I feel violated that people are making money out of me, um, or out of, out of the part of me that put that uh, that I'm the reason why I exist on this planet. People making money out of that, and I just don't like that. I feel violated and exploited, and and I feel the same way with extraterrestrials out there. I feel that they are violated and exploited, that they're actually um um and then you tell me to get real seriously um it's the reason why there's so much misinformation out there and lies and anti extraterrestrial gender and all that crap is all because of sensationalism and people want to make money out of the topic and I do support the, um, the the disclosure of extraterrestrials but I do not support the money disease that is actually making um, um, people who have actually experienced something generally the laughing stock 
of society and and this is why I do not wish to share my information to the point where people make money out of it. Um, um, one of the reasons why I tend to just personally share my information, um, the reason I just don't want it, I just want I, I just share the information like many other experiences in my life, uh, uh, which is not related to extraterrestrials. And this is the thing is, um, everything is just money, 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 money. And I just don't like it. And money is actually killing the planet. Um, and and um, the extraterrestrials are wanting to help. And it's the money disease and the industrial military complex that's basically uh, suppressing all this. And, and, um, Seriously, uh, that's what I have to say, and um, and um, I just feel a bit violated as as well because I uh, have a part of a um, part of extraterrestrial, and um, and um, and I've noticed in my life when I try to look for employment, all that I got rejected and all that because I look alien, um, and many things like that, and. Um, and then there's people that are making money out of the whole subject which really um, disturbs me and all that so I'm actually doing you a video response because I can't comment on your things uh, because I don't know what's, what the hell is going on here and um, And um, seriously, um, telling me to get real is really, um, I found that rather antagonizing um, that, about that um, because the reality of it, truth does not come with a price tag attached to it. Anything that has a price tag attached to it um, and is claimed to be truth often has a lot of sensationalism and added fiction. To it, which is many, which is one of the reasons why people who are skeptic about it and who have never experienced anything uh, kind of dismiss it because they see it as a big fat money racket. And that's what I'm going to say. I'll, you know, truth shouldn't be sold, shouldn't have a price tag attached to it, and the the, the, the truth shouldn't be marketed. And it's the whole money disease thing, which I basically put it up, but just against capitalism, the money disease, and all that. And I support paradigm, and I recommend you go to paradigm.org and learn about um, focusing on building a society without work or money, and and everything, you know, with, with, and with advanced technology and all that, and the technology which these governments are sitting on. Um, is capable of um, um, putting the first steps of paradigm into reality, and because um, the first one of the most important things um, is energy, and energy can neither be created nor destroyed; it's only transferred from one form into another, and it's a delusion to say that these companies generate electricity. They don't generate electricity, all they do is just convert the energy from one form to another and then they sell it. Um, that's what I, uh, I've got to say. And, um, and, and then, you know, I, I have signed the petition before, but I do not support um, contaminating the um, disclosure. With the money disease, because when I've observed what actually happens is uh, when that actually happens, it gets contaminated with misinformation and sensationalism, and the truth gets um, drowned with uh, misinformation. And to be honest, um, the ultimate disclosure is when the extraterrestrials have a first contact appearance when. The majority of the people understand and accept the extraterrestrials as not being a threat, 
and um, and then have an embassy where to trust us to a land and all that. Um, and um, making money out of them is just they don't they don't want that. They don't want to be exploited like that, which is one of the reasons why this year on the um, the contact in the desert that didn't really experience much um, extraterrestrial activity that did but they never experienced what they anticipated is because it was a money extortion and a money racket and it's basically why I am against this whole thing when people make money of extraterrestrial because there's a lot of sensationalism and misinformation that gets blended in with the truth and makes it very difficult and less creditable and particularly um, um, in the eyes of the skeptics who just basically want dead straight facts and um, and often um, most um, um, extraterrestrial experiences do not have much evidence um, because it's like once in the blue moon these things happen and um, it come, they do come as a surprise and gathering evidence to support an you know, experience is very difficult because you don't expect anything to happen and often people because once it's contaminated with a money disease often people make stories up and claim they've experienced something when they haven't but they do it just to get money and um, honestly um, um, this is what, I, what I'm very much upset about and then telling me to get real um, seriously just you know makes me steam up and choose to I think I'll finish it at that